nobody. What up, y'all? Dan Potterman here at IllinoisHSBasketball.com. I'm at the CPS shootout at Chicago State University. I'm here with Wayne Blackshear at Morgan Park. Wayne has started off the season really hot, had a couple great games, and you had over 40 in this one, right? Yeah. First off, tell me about the start to the season. Uh, obviously, you had great expectations coming into the season as the number one junior in the state, and you've stepped up and exceeded a lot of people's expectations. What's that been like? Well, you know, a lot of people thought I wasn't going to be able to play, and a lot of people thought... I was gonna fall off, so I think I had something to prove when I came out uh, at the beginning of the season. You know, moving on to the Mr. Basketball talk. I know it's really way too early to think about it. You know, State Player of the Year. You and Jeremy Richmond are both great players. A lot of people, you know, are saying well, coming into the season were saying you know Jeremy was gonna run away with it, but you've stepped up big time. Is that something you're kind of thinking about a little bit? Uh, of course, you know, um, it's something I'm gonna have under my belt in my high school career. So. Um, you know, Jay Rich, he's going to have to fight for him. And, you know, I call him every day. We're him best friends. We talk about it. We always tell each other our stats um, about the, uh, our games. You know, I'm going to call him later and tell him. Tell him I'm on his tail, you know. He's not just, I'm just not going to just let him get it. Uh, he's going to have to earn it. Court, you get my highlights. Blackshear's development as a player, he's always been right on the fringe kind of, of being you know, one of those elite, elite players in the nation. And he seems to have gotten over that hump this summer when he had some breakout tournaments and now he's playing outstanding. What, what's it been like watching that development and being a part of that? Oh, I mean, it's it, it been, it been great. You know, Wayne, Wayne's a hard worker. And from where Wayne came from to now, it's a, it's a uh, big step for him, you know, because he, he put the time in. And what what what's what he going through right now, he deserves everything. And to show that they can go back and forth and answer your questions and tell them. Now the level that he's playing at this season is obviously, I mean, being such a great player, you expect him to play at a high level, but were you expecting that he would start off this high? Well, he he, he doing what I told him to, basically, you know. I, I expect a uh, well, I demand a lot from Wayne. You know, I, I told him if you want to be one of the the greatest player ever come out of Chicago, you got to go out and prove it every night. You know, I, I told him, you, you just can't, you know, go out there and, and not be aggressive, passive. You got to go and play hard, and that's what he doing. So now, do you think that it is a possibility, I know it's really too early to speculate that Wayne might go from coming into the season as, you know, questioning if people question if he's even going to be able to play to now being Mr. Basketball? I mean, a lot of people said he wasn't going to be able to play, but I always knew Wayne's talents. I always knew Wayne would be mentioned as, as Mr. Basketball because he, he that talented and that good. And, you know, right now he should be mentioned, you know, but he got to stay on his pace. 